For this video, I am going to compare Quillbot and Grammarly. So first, I am going to discuss Quillbot and before we continue, I have a link in the description down below so you can use that link in signing up for Quillbot. So let us continue. So Quillbot is an AI-powered paraphrasing tool that helps users to write and even enhance their text. So it also includes features like grammar checking, summarization right here, and even citation generation. So for the key features, uh, first we have paraphraser. So I am already at the paraphraser section here in Quillbot. So paraphrasing offers multiple modes like the standard, the fluency, creative right here, formal, academic, simple, creative, expand, shorten, and custom. But for this custom feature, it is only available for the premium account. So um, to rephrase, it is available to rephrase text while maintaining the original meaning. So next one is the grammar checker. So for the grammar checker, this tool is used to identify and correct grammatical errors. And then for the summarizer, so this condenses long texts into shorter summaries. And the next one is the citation generator. So this um, format citations in various styles like APA, MLA, Chicago, and etc. So users just need to paste their sources right here and then hit this site button right here and then Quillbot will automatically give them the formatted citation of that specific source that they have pasted right here. So for the strength of Quillbot, so it has versatile paraphrasing. So the multiple modes right here allows users to tailor the output to their specific needs and it is also affordable. So generally more affordable than Grammarly. So with both free and premium options and also for the ease of use. So the Interface of Quillbot is fairly simple and it is easy to use. So that makes it easy to navigate also. So next one is the multiple tools. So I have what I have shown you earlier. So it combines paraphrasing, summarizing, and citation generation in, in one platform. So for the weaknesses, so it has limited grammar checking. So while in it includes grammar checker, it, it is not as advanced or comprehensive as Grammarly's, so it also lacks a built-in plagiarism checker, which can be crucial for academic and professional writing. So, so sorry, it actually has this plagiarism checker right here, but you actually need to upgrade your account into a premium account. So next is the, it primarily also focuses on the writing style. So since it primarily, Marily focuses on paraphrasing and does not provide extensive feedback on writing and style and tone. So that might be a downside for this tool right here. So this tool or Quillbot is ideal for students, content creators, and writers seeking simplicity. So if you are um, user that is only looking for a tool that you can use to paraphrase and do the basic editing. You can use par or you can use Quillbot. And now let us go to Grammarly. So for the Grammarly, so this is a comprehensive writing assistant that focuses on improving your grammar. Hence Grammarly. So the spelling, also the punctuation, style, and tone. So it is widely used by professionals, students, and even casual writers. So the key features for it is first one is the grammar and spelling or spell checking capabilities. Next one is the style slash tone suggestion. So it provides feedback on the writing style and tone and the readability of your texts. So as you can see right here, it reviews suggestions. So it has correctness, the clarity, engagement, and the delivery. So it basically reads your writings right here. So this is a demo document by Grammarly. So I'm just using it also to show you the features of it. So next, what you can do also for here is the plagiarism checker. So it also detects potential plagiarism by comparing texts against a database of academic papers and web content. So also, also their writing insights. So it offers insights and suggestions to improve clarity, engagement, and even delivery. 
So for the integration, um, it can be available as browser extension, desktop app also with various platforms and it, it, it integrates with that such as Google Docs, Microsoft Word. And now for the strength of Grammarly, so it has comprehensive grammar checker, style and tone feedback as I said earlier plagiarism detection and seamless integration so for the weakness it is generally more costly than the willbot so the premium plans can be expensive again compared to the writing tools and it is less focused on paraphrasing so while it provides rephrasing suggestions it is not as focused on paraphrasing as quillbot and for the potential over correction so sometimes suggests changes that may not align with the writer's intended style or voice so Grammarly is ideal for the professionals students and academics and even writers seeking detailed feedback so for the head-to-head -head comparison, so Killbot excels in paraphrasing with multiple modes tailored to different needs while Grammarly provides paraphrasing or rephrasing suggestions but is not focused on comprehensive paraphrasing. For the grammar and spelling checking or spell checking, Killbot offers basic grammar checking is sufficient for minor corrections and comparatively to Grammarly, superior grammar or it has superior grammar checking with advanced error detection and correction capabilities. Now for the style and tone, Killbot or has limited focus on style and tone while Grammarly has extensive feedback on the writing style, the tone, clarity, and even the readability. And now for the conclusion, so Killbot is overall ideal for users who are seeking an affordable and versatile paraphrasing tool with additional features like summarizing, citation, generation. So it is particularly useful for students and content creators as I've said earlier who need a simple and effective way to enhance their writing and for Grammarly, it is the superior choice for those who's needing a comprehensive grammar checking style and tone feedback and plagiarism detection so um it's robust features and seamless integration or makes it perfect for professionals academics and writers seeking detailed feedback and polished writing so both tools serve different purposes and excel in their respective areas depending on your specific needs. So just whether it is advanced grammar checking and plagiarism detection or versatile paraphrasing and summarizing either both or either Killbot or Grammarly can be the right choice for enhancing your writing. So that's it for today's video and I hope this helped you. And if it did, please make sure to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell button. Thank you so much for watching and have a great day.